I uh, just got this box. Let's open it up. This guy. I've had my eye on it for a while and I finally figured out how I was going to use it. So I pulled the trigger. The funny thing is I ordered it on a Wednesday and today's Thursday and I got it. What this is, it's, ah, it's not that big, that's nice. What this is, this is a big, big battery. This can charge my iPhone 7 Plus, I think four times before I have to recharge this. So this is just one giant battery. It doesn't weigh that much actually. And the nice thing about it, three USB A's and I can run my USB C devices or run my GoPros off of this. So that way I can do an all day time lapse, which I've been playing around with and I'm gonna have one, one up shortly. With this guy, I'll be able to power it all day. And I can have it in my bag and use it to charge in the field if I have to. And I'm gonna plug it in and take a look. Comes with a bag, so you can put this in, and two USB-A to micro USB cables. This is a giant battery. Has USB A's and micro USB inputs. Two USB, these are uh, meant for charging it faster. And these are my outputs, so I can plug any USB A into it, which is almost anything. And I'm going to go ahead and plug these guys in. Now, as you can see, oh, the interesting thing is because I'm doing this at a higher frame rate. Okay, since I'm doing this at a higher frame rate, I'm recording this at 60 frames a second, it catches these as, as flashing, which in the reality they're not. But right now it came to me with two, two bars of four bars charging, and it's charging on the, uh, on the third bar right there. This thing is supposed to take from zero to fully charged, it's supposed to take six hours. So I won't be using this until tomorrow anyway, so I'm going to go ahead and leave this to charge and should be should be good to go